It's time for the show where your imagination fills in the blanks. It's And now, here's your host, David Sedoni. our special holiday edition of Mad Libs, where you get your holiday fun and your Mad Libs fun all in one. Mad Libs are the world's greatest word game. A Mad Lib is a story that's missing a few words, and it's up to you to fill in all the blanks with your own creative and unusual words. Today we have two festive teams that are going to be running around playing a bunch of physical and mental games designed to take the Mad Lib, lift it off the page, and bring it to life. You want to start? Let's start. Bring out the teams. Come on. Come on out, gang. All right, teams, welcome to our holiday show. Girls, do you guys know you got uh, cats on your hats? Yeah. Cats on your hats. Yeah. They're all over the place. Let's find out who we got playing. First up, we got Jamal. How you doing, dude? I'm fine. Welcome to the show. Uh, tell me about yourself. You got any special talents, any moves, anything? Yeah, I'm a dancer. Show me your moves. Dance it out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> The hitchhiker. Do you know the sprinkler? Uh, Follow me. <laughs> Good job. All right. Your partner over here is Anlin. Anlin, how are you? I'm fine. Uh, okay, now you got a little cat on your head now. Since we're in the holiday show, ask me, do you like this? Do you like my reindeer? Yeah. Would you wear a reindeer like this out in the holidays? Sure, why not? Uh, I was just checking. I, <laughs> I, I, you know, I just like to check my fashion with all the girls. Oh, okay, oh, thanks I a lot. Why. <laughs> <laughs> Let's check out your opponents over here. Blue team, how you doing? Good. Good. Tell me about uh, yourself, Melissa. What's the best gift you've ever gotten in the holiday times? Best gift probably be cash. Cash? <laughs> you just woke up one morning, there was cash on your bed? All right, all right, cool. <laughs> Let's meet your partner over here. Ellis, how you doing, buddy? I'm all right, man. Tell me about your worst holiday gift. You got a worst? Clothes. Clothes. Oh, like socks from your grandma? I hate when I get that. Yeah. Or underwear? That's the worst. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, dude. This is, this is your nightmare, not mine. I'm just trying to find out. <laughs> These are our teams. Give them a hand, everybody. put some dynamite in the dictionary as these two teams compete to earn the most points to move on to the maximum Mad Lib. And today's special holiday grand prize, each of you and a guest are going to win plane tickets, hotel, and free passes, are you ready, to Disney World in Florida. <laughs> Vegas trip. All paid for. Yeah, that's the best part. Uh, Melissa, I don't think there's any cash, but, you know, everything is free, so that's all right. As long as it's free. <laughs> but our first round we like to do is we like to let some of the viewers at home get involved by letting them fill in all the blanks in our first Mad Lib of the day. Let's take a look at the viewer Mad Lib. Hi, my name is Michelle, and I go to Nancy Corey Elementary School. The Mad Lib that I wrote is called Trimming the Tree. When decorating the Christmas tree, I attach the colored kitten to the top and wrap a garland of teeth around it. Then I fling the shiny ornaments and finish it off by putting butterballs all over the branches. Have a great game! Sounds like some interesting holiday fun. Tell you what, let's take the teams. Let's make it into a game. Follow me. Red team right here. Blue team right here. All right, I'll tell you what. Girls, why don't you take your cat and the hats and go put on your Christmas trees, all right? Guys, you hang out here with me. Here's what they got to do. The girls are going to start down here. Guys are going to be hanging over here. They're going to have these Christmas trees complete with their teeth garland, directly from our viewer Mad Lib, and a bright, shiny cat on top. <laughs> now, the guys are going to be over here, and they're going to be catapulting. As they catapult, they're going to be catapulting butterballs. The team that gets the most butterballs stuck on their tree in 45 seconds, they're the winner, and they get the first 20 points of the day. All right? Let's get in positions. Guys, man your catapults. Here we go. Let's put 45 seconds up on the clock. All right, guys, ready? On your mark. Get set. Go! There go the first one. Get some on there. Oh, Red Team's got one right on the 
That's it, that's it, that's it. That last one went right after the buzzer, Jamal. So we're gonna have to pull that last one. That last one went after the buzzer. You know the way it's gotta be out of the hands before it gets released. This one was late. We're not gonna count that one. Let's take a look. Red team, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven for the red team. The blue team looks like they got one, two, three, four, five, six for the red team. Still in the winning my way. Come on over here, guys. Come on over here, blue team. Nice job, red team. Way to go, guys. Well, that's great. Girls, you can take off your goggles and drop your trees. We're going to take a look at the scoreboard. That's 20 points for the red team, just barely, by one butter ball. They're in the lead. Blue team, don't stress. We got a whole bunch more games where you can have a chance to earn a lot more points. You ready to go on to the next round? I know yeah. you are, because you got a goose egg right now. Are you ready to go? <laughs> All right, let's go to round two. Come on, everybody, let's go. All right. Come on in here, gang. Right now, we're going to find out which team is madder than the other one when we do madder than you. Now, you guys know, the key to being a super skilled Mad Libber, you gotta have a huge, fat vocabulary. The more words you have, the more options you have to fill in all the blanks. In this game, I'm gonna give you guys a category. Then you gotta rack your brain and come up with all the words that fit into the category. Each time you spit out a word that's correct, you take our Mad Lib gift package here and you swing it over to the other team. When the other team thinks of a word, they swing it right back. Now the gift keeps going back and forth and back and forth till one team runs out of words. When that happens, category's over, the other team gets the five points. Remember, you cannot repeat another player's answer or a different form of the same word. Very important. All right, we're gonna do this for two minutes. Bust through as many categories as you can. Girls, why don't you go first, guys? You're on deck. Get in positions, please. Two minutes on the clock. Good luck to you. Here comes your first category. Christmas carols. Go. Jingle bells. Um, Santa Claus. Santa Claus. I, I don't know that one. All right, that's five <laughs> points for the blue team. Nice job. Next category. Ready? Things you do in snow. Go. Snowboarding. Ski. Make angels. Make snowmen. Throw house snow fights. Throw igloos. Make snow people. I think that's pretty much the same thing as snowmen. We don't want to have any gender problems here, all right? So that's five points for the red team. Nice job. We're going to go on. But guys, you did good. That's a lot of snow stuff. Here we go. Gifts in the song, 12 Days of Christmas. Gifts in the song, 12 Days of Christmas. Go. Partridge in a pear tree. On the street. The rain. Uh, they didn't give you that one for geese laying. It was close. You almost got out. The geese laying. I don't think that's a gift. All right. That's five points for the red team. Next round. All right, you guys. Names of Santa's reindeer. Names of Santa's reindeer. Rudolph. Nixon. <laughs> He's a president, not a reindeer. We're looking for Vixen or one of those guys. That's five points for the red team. Next category. Warm drinks. Warm hot drinks. Hot cocoa. Hot milk. Cappuccino. Hot cider. Mocolata. Cappuccino. That's a repeat. Already had cappuccino. That's five points for the red team. Next one. Ready? Things associated with Hanukkah. Go. Christmas. <laughs> That's separate. Okay, five points for the blue team. Next category, ready? Christmas tree decorations. Lights. Um, ornaments. Um, garland. Gingerbread people. Time's up, time's up. No points for that category. Come on in, let's take a look at the scoreboard. Blue team, nice job. You guys got on the board. You got 10 points. Red team still in the lead, though, with 40 points. We got a lot more to go, though. Now we're going to see these guys. When we come back, they're going to be going to the mega stunt, holiday style, running around doing crazy big stuff when we come back.